So before I start this um, review, I just want to say I pissed off the One Piece fanboy so bad <laughs> from my other video, which I was actually serious about. That was not even a joke. And they're attacking, saying <laughs> you're annoying stuff because it's that F Sanji, but I don't care. Now to this review. This anime episode was finale. This was the finale. I gotta put that in my title. Amazing. Holy crap. I was anticipating this episode the whole week. I was talking to my friend about this episode. He watches the series. We were hyped. We were like, next week's episode is going to be amazing. Next week's episode is going to be amazing. Amazing finale. Please, season three. Please, season three. Please, there, there got to be a season three. Oh, my goodness. So, we start off the episode with Yu, um, Yo, Yuichiro versus Guren. And I'm like, whoa, 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 what the hell is happening? Why are they fighting? And then I check, am I in the right episode? The two episodes come out? But no, I was in the right episode after I confirmed that. I was like, oh yeah, Guren, um, he has that dual personality and his dead girlfriend is controlling him now. Doing all of these actions and actually initiating Seraph of the End by killing the vampires and human soldiers and Seraph of the End feeding on it. And the person that was Seraph of the End was Mirai, Ki um, Kamisuki's little sister. She was being experimented on. And I'm like, oh crap, Seraph of the End is like an angel. It had wings and everything. Nope, a trumpet appeared. Just like the one from you had in his uh, mind mind state when he's about to die and stuff and she blows on it and a huge demon comes out her, like her back and stuff and that's actually the fifth trumpet that's the name of it the fifth trumpet and i was like holy crap it releases these things that starts eating vampires and humans all around um then we get you um you you basically he 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 wants to go save good. He wants to save his family. He does not want to see his family dead again. And Mika's just like, let's just go you. And you it's not having that. He gets his sword, stabs his heart. I'm pretty sure that was his heart. It's in the dying state, I guess. Picks up the trumpet. Betrays his demon powers, blows on it. And I said this, I said this a long time ago in my last review of Seraph the End. That the trumpet will be in effect. That we will see this trumpet again. I hoped we will see this trumpet again. And we did. He blows on the trumpet. He becomes the second trumpet. Um, I forget the exact name of it. But it's like demons. I guess the trumpet demons are of the highest category. He's the second trumpet. He's the king of salt. A bunch of soldiers are ordered to kill you. As well as the fifth trumpet and they all attack he unleashes this wave of salt that when it touches them when it touches them they disintegrate into salt i was like holy crap holy crap i was like so hype after this you run to meet i um well the demon um more to be more specific goes to it slashes it with a sword it turns into salt and then has a beam. When it's above it, throws the beam at it. Boom, disintegrated. Um, and Mirai is still okay. She fell down to the earth. After this, Hira Hiragi gets so mad, charges at you. You fights back. Both clash. I was like, yo, this episode was amazing. Holy crap! I love my favorite scene. In this episode was the the sea of salt, like the wave of salt. I mean, I meant to say. I was like, holy crap and to revert back to his human form well not his human form really um the demon takes over to control the form the second trumpet form and he goes he turns it into a demon and i'm going to talk more about that later but ferret he basically kills the queen the queen snaps crowley's neck crowley does like this his neck is not he just he was supposed to be dead supposed to be dead sorry about that and he's like, mm, that nap was nice. Like, 
his neck didn't just get snapped. How strong is Crowley? Would he have been a match for you in the second trumpet state? Yo, this is getting so interesting. He then declares himself the leader, Ferret. And after all of these events, and they save you and stuff and run away, they basically um, have a four month time skip. Um, and and you is like, we gotta save Guden, we're going back to the place we ran away from, and he's in his normal human state. And if you were wondering how he achieved his regular state again it's from the demon, it was probably Kamisuki uh, with his special demon um, cough and he made he reverted you back into a human Mika's fine and they're going back so hopefully there's a season three because is is the mission to get Mirai back and get Guren back he didn't say get Mirai back but of course um Kamisuki wants to get his sister back who wouldn't like she was experimented on she was supposed to she was supposed to be getting treatment yeah treatment being it she was a lab rat also, I wish there was more explanation about um, use Seraph of the End. Like, uh, Gordon had other means and stuff. Maybe his other personality, his regular form, um, did this because to counter his other form that wanted to help Hiragi. And in, even the four month time skip, Gordon is still being controlled and he's on Hiragi's side. And he's like, I guess, thanking in command next to Hiragi because they have like the same um, jacket on and stuff. Overall, this ending was amazing. This ending made me rate the series overall this season a 9 out of 10 from an 8 out of 10. It gave me one whole ranking because it was so amazing. This is not a perfect series, but this was an amazing ending. I, I talk so much good stuff about the ending. You're probably wondering, what is the final score? What are you rating this? What are you giving this ending? 10 out of 10. Perfect. Hope you enjoyed this review and if you did, remember to have a great day. Peace.